This is Quarantine TV, the show that will help you alleviate your boredom for at least 15 minutes. Broadcasting live from a hidden studio high atop Southwest Portland, this is Quarantine TV with your host, Madison Avenue. Hi, everybody. It's time for another episode of Quarantine TV, something to keep you occupied while we are in the lockdown here in Stumptown. It's not really lockdown. You know, uh, I just want to make sure people know you can go outside. In fact, I encourage it. It's so beautiful out there, as you just saw. Uh, Go outside, get some fresh air, get some vitamin D, get some sun in your skin. Where It's not a nuclear fallout thing or, uh, you know, it's just when we gather with people. Or have, you know, casual sex or uh, the kissing booths or, you know, you just, you get it from passing it by person to person in the air. So uh, I heard it can also get passed by farting. So stay away from that. And if you're going to do that, please announce everybody, I'm about to fart. Move away. (laughs) You know, the silent but deadly may be true in this case. In fact, I kind of, I'm really liking this. This is week four where... uh, the, the college has been closed, so I don't have to go to work. And I'm getting really lazy. I'm sleeping until 10.30. I'm living the life of Riley, whoever Riley is. Whoever Riley was, he had it pretty good. And um, so I'm getting used to this. I don't have any friends. I don't go out with anyone anyway. So I, the most the thing I miss is restaurants. So I'm trying to make the food that I would get at a restaurant right here at home. And it's really pretty simple. Cooking is really easy. My ex-wife gave me a great recipe for ice once. <laughs> and she gave me another good re- recipe for boiling water. Actually, you know, I've been cooking since I was, you know, like nine. That's why I'm so fat. Here, let's take a look at a couple of Mad Magazine, the lighter side of skits. And we'll be right back on Quarantine TV. Stick around. You got no place to go. Join me now as we enter into Mad Magazine's The Lighter Side. Sir? Yeah? Do you know why I stopped here? Uh, no. Well, the speed limit's 20 miles an hour. You're doing at least 50. Oh, heck, I was doing at least 75. Uh, excuse me, officer, you can't believe a word this man says. Why not? Because he always exaggerates when he's drunk. You been drinking, sir? <clears throat> uh, yeah. I, I heard she told me. I can't believe it. <laughs> I know. I know I heard she told me. I can't believe it. I what is wrong with these people? I can't believe it. Come on, Jenny, get off the phone. Everybody's waiting for you. Been on that thing all day. If I had a cordless phone like everyone else in the world, maybe I could get more than one thing done at a time. I could be out there and I could talk on the phone too. I don't want you to talk on the phone. You're practically married to the damn thing instead of me. Now come on, hang up. I'm not done yet. Could you just get me a cordless phone, please, honey, please? That's all I want is a cordless phone, please, baby. So if I get you a cordless phone, you'll come out here, you'll take care of your friends who've come over and waited all day, and everything is going to be fine and dandy, right? I promise. I love you, Sudoku. You promise? I promise. I've got a surprise for you. Don't go away. <sighs> oh, man. I know. I'm very lucky. I think he's got a present for me. I think it's the cordless phone I've been wanting. Oh, we'll just see. We'll see. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Amazing. Oh, wait, here it comes. It comes. All right. Oh, bye. 
Hi, honey. I got something for you. Present? Yeah, betcha. Really? Can you guess what it is? A cordless phone? That's right. Honey, no! Oh. Here's your cordless oh. phone, honey. And hi, I'm back. I'm Madison Avenue. And, um, well, you know, I love my my barkup singer who who left us after a long time with the band, Bear. Our lovable Bear, the Barkin' Up singer, he's going to be, he's going to have his own special here on Macomb Entertainment. Macomb Vision will present the story of Bear. But not right now. Right now, we're going to cut to my song, my famous song, my most famous song, the hit that's on Greatest Hits Volume 2, my first album. This is called All I Want is a Cookie, which you have seen a million times if you've been following the career of Madison Avenue. And Bear does a Bang up job with the bark up vocals on this one. And so, right now, all I want is a cookie. So, Bear, this is for you. This is a cookie song. Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, we'll be right back with some more here on the Madison Avenue Show. Don't you go away. Right now we're doing pretty good. Let's keep it that way. Let's stay home and stay safe and uh, don't kill anybody. I'm sure there's lawyers around the corner wringing their hands waiting to sue somebody for getting somebody else sick. Right? It's what lawyers do. Being a lawyer, that's the eighth deadly sin. So anyway, here we go. This is Jesse Samsel with the Blues All-Stars singing uh, People Get Ready, so get ready. A song by the name of Curtis Mayfield wrote a song called People Get Ready. 
took it serious. I was like, oh, well, we better take this serious. So uh, take this serious. Take the COVID serious. Stay home. Do the right thing. Stay healthy. That's all they ask. We can do that. And uh, let's get creative. I'm Madison Avenue, and this is Quarantine TV. Thank you.
Wow. <laughs>